And the next matter we call is uh, item five, the matter of Kelly Keynes and James Alex. I'm, I'm present. I accept your oath to office. Um, before this tribunal begins, I'm making a special appearance to this hearing. I reserve all my rights and remedies, and I never waive any rights ever. I responded to this meeting in writing. I just want my child. I want this court to honor my right as a parent to have access to my child. I want the court to just ensure my child is delivered to me. When can I see my child? So the, let me back up a little bit. The matters calendared regarding Ms. Stain's uh, request to address custody and visitation issues. And then we did refer you folks to Family Court Services to uh, try to work out a parenting plan. We got a report from March 9th. Um, you know, there's really no recommendation. Um, so Ms. Anderson, have you and your client had a chance to review the report? Well, there is no recommendation because Mr. Alex didn't appear, and so I'm assuming the court is just going to re-refer us to Family Court Services so that he can participate. Probably, but I mean, you, yeah, I'm thinking you and your client at least read the report, right? Yes, we have read the report. And Mr. Alex, have you had a chance? I responded to that meeting in writing. I just want my child. I'm not here for anything else. I want this court to honor my right as a parent and to have access to my child. I want to, okay. the court to ensure that my child is delivered to me. When can I see my child? Okay, well, I mean, that's the whole idea of referring your folks to family court services so you can try to kind of lock with, you, hopefully we get try to get an agreement on this plan. Because I think you're in Colorado, right? I'm, yeah, I'm not here for anything else other than to get my child, your honor. Okay, and mom's here in Sacramento, so it's a, you know, that's the whole idea to have to put something together where you both will have custody of the child. Um, so, and uh, so, what do you what are you asking? Do you want? I mean, what would your proposal be regarding parenting? Plan? I want the court to honor my right as a parent to have access to my child, equal access. I want the court to just ensure that my child is delivered to me. When am I going to see my child? It's been way too long. Okay. Well, I mean, and here's the thing, though. Your child's about three, right? Correct. So you, you mentioned equal access. How does that's the whole idea? How does that work with one parent in Colorado and the other in Sacramento? I just want the court to honor my right as a parent to have access to my child. Okay. Well, you might want to. I, I can't give you advice, but you might want to put aside the. The mother and I can deal with it. There's no jurisdiction. I haven't given up any jurisdiction to myself nor my child. The mother and I can deal with this. Thank you. I just okay, want to see not, my child. If you're not, if, are you saying the court does not have jurisdiction? I just want to see my child. I'm not interested in anything else. I'm here to get my child. When can I see my child? Well, first you got to go to family court services. It might help to talk to those folks. So... Uh, that's and I, that's what we're gonna do is re refer you back to family court services. So I'm looking at probably May third or fifth for a, and that's a court date, not not the actual mediation. Date. Either day is fine with me, Your Honor. Okay, so we'll go with Monday, May third at nine o'clock in this apartment. So again, so we're going to try one more time. So what happens is, and I, I'm not sure how involved you got the last time, but the, uh, you folks are going to have an appointment, a Zoom appointment with a, a person that's an expert on custody issues. And that person's going to want to talk to both of you and try to come up with a plan that works, given the fact that you've got what, over a thousand miles, about a thousand miles gap in distance between the two of you. Um, 
So I would strongly encourage you to, you know, to participate with Family Court Services. Um, Ms. Anderson, do you have any ideas about what type of parenting plan would work between now and that next court day? Well, we have invited Mr. Alex to come to California to have a visit. Because of the length of time, we want to have at least an opportunity to reintroduce the child to the dad. And so we were thinking of some informal supervision, but he won't come here and she can't afford to go there. I'm not interested in any of that. All I want is access to my child, Your Honor. You have the authority and power to give me access to my child. Please allow me to have access to my child. I want the court to just ensure my child is delivered to me. When can I see my child? So at least from, again, I'm, I'm, only get, I'm getting the information I get is mainly from mother. And what I found is that uh, it's been since like June of 2020 that you've been present with your child. So this is all in writing, Your Honor. It's, it's, all, it's in writing. I responded to all this in writing. It's right oh, in front okay. of you. I oh, just want my okay. child. And you may get your child, but not until the next court date. So you might want to put aside the equal rights and just say, let's get real. Let's talk about a way we can make this work uh, to effectively raise this child. So uh, I, that's my only thought is uh, you might want to just kind of get more practical on this matter. So the next court date is May 3rd at 9 o'clock. Um, I'm not going to schedule. I'll indicate, sir, you can have parenting time in California, and it will be in mother's presence. You have no jurisdiction over this matter, sir. Okay. You got, actually, you I got haven't given up any that. jurisdiction. I want access to my, my child. Mr. I have a given you right. Need, you need to be clear on that. If I don't have jurisdiction, if you're saying I don't have jurisdiction, that's fine. But on the other hand, you're asking me to make orders. So it's one of the two. So uh, we'll figure that out on May 3rd. Thank you. Thank you, Adam. Thank you. Thank you.